This video is about testing a bulb connected with a denied sensor. See here, when the sensor faces the bulb's light, the bulb automatically turns off. Amazing, right? For this experiment, I'm using three things. A daylight sensor and a LED bulb and a power cord. This is a denied sensor. It works automatically. When it's dark, it turns on the connected device and when there's light, it switches it off. These sensors are available in the market with different ratings, usually from 3 amps to 10 amps. Here I'm using a 10 amp sensor which is switchable for most home appliances. You will often see this type of sensor used in street lights, garden lights, outdoor security lights and even in some home appliances to save electricity. The benefit is that you don't have to turn the light on or off manually, it works completely on its own. On the sensor body, you can see the wiring diagram. The white wire is for neutral, the red wire is for load, and the black wire is for AC input. I'll now connect the wires step by step, joining the neutral wire with the bulb. black wire with the power cord and red load wire with the bulbs other terminal. Finally, I am securing all the joints properly with tape to prevent any short circuit. Now let's test this. I'll place the sensor inside a small cover to block light. And yes, the bulb turns on. When I remove the cover, the bulb switches off automatically. Now let's test in darkness. I'm turning off all the room lights. And it's working perfectly. The bulb is switching on and off depending on the surrounding lights. So this is how a denied sensor works with a bulb. useful don't forget to like share and subscribe for more electronics experiments thank you